short Christmas story that is called Totoro. What Christmas is as we grow older from Charles Dickens in his book Some Short Christmas Stories. So I really hope you enjoy this. I'm going to, you know, try my best reading. So, you know, I, I can read on English but I'm not the best reader so I'm sorry about that. And also, Christmas special is coming on Thursday. Don't miss it. So, let's get to the story. Let me grab it closer. Closer. What Christmas is as we grow older? Time was with most of us when Christmas Day ends their Magic ring left nothing out of us to miss or seek. Bound together all our own enjoyments, affections, and hopes. Group it, group it, group it, everything and everyone around the Christmas fire and made the little picture shining in our bright, charm eyes. So soon, when our thoughts overleap the narrow boundary, when there was someone very dear, we told them, very beautiful and absolutely perfect, wanting the fullness of our happiness. When we were wanting to, or we talked so, which did, which did just as well. At the Christmas heart, by wish that some, someone sat, and when we interview, in their wine, with every red and garland of our life, that someone's name, that was the time for the bright visionary Christmases, which have long arisen from us to show faintly, after summer rain in the palest edges of the rainbow, rainbow, rainbow. I don't know if I'm reading too fast. I'm sorry if I'm reading too fast. That was the time for the beatified enjoyment of the things that were to be and never were, and yet the things that were so real in, in our resolute hope that it would be hard to say now what realities and shift things have been stronger what did the Christmas never really so never, Christmas never really come when we at the priceless peril who was our joy, joy, choice 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 were received after the happiness of totally impossible marriage by the two united families previously dollars drowned or on our account when brothers and sisters in law who, who had always been rather cool to us before our relationship was affected perfectly perfectly dotted on us and were fathers and mothers overwhelmed us with unlimited incomes was that Christmas dinner never really eaten, e eaten, eaten, I don't know, sorry, after which we arose and generously and eloquently rendered honor to our late rival, present in the company, then and there it's changing friendship and forgiveness, and founding an attachment not to be surpassed, in Greek or Roman story, 
shower of tears of joy. Is it possible that Christmas has not come yet? And is our life here at the best so consistible? <laughs> Sorry again. Um, that pausing as we advance at such unnoticeable miles. As we advance at such some milestone in the track as this great birthday, we look back on the one things that that never were as lathered and full and gravely as on the things that have been and have been and are gone, or have been and still here. If it if it be so, and so it seems to be, most we be. We come to the conclusion, conclusion that life is little than a better dream, a little word, the love and string, and that we grow into it. No, far be such mystical philosophy from us, dear reader, on Christmas days, nearer and closer to our hearts, to the Christmas spirit, which is the spirit of active. Usefulness, perseverance, cheerful, discharge of duty, kindness, and forbearance. It is the last virtue, especially that we are to be strengthened by the unaccomplished visions of our children. For who shall say they are not our teachers to deal gently, even with the impalpable knowings of the earth? Therefore, as we grow older, let us be more thankful. That the circle of our Christmas associations and of the lesson that they bring expands. Let us welcome every one of them and summon them to make their places by the Christmas heart. Welcome, old aspiration, glittering creature of an ardent fancy, to, to your shelter underneath the holly. We know you and have not only with you yet. Welcome all projects and all love, however fleeting, to your nooks among these theater lights that burn around us. Welcome all that was never real to our hearts and for the earnestness that made you real. Thanks to heaven. Christmas castles in the clouds now. Let our thoughts, 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 doubts, sorry, fluttering like butterflies among these flowers full of children, bear witness before this boy. They're stretched out of a future brighter than we never look in our old romantic time.
ho 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 Merry Christmas We shall not discard you You shall all your share in it places In our Christmas hearts And by our Christmas fire And in the season of immortal hope And on the birthday of immortal mercy We will shut out nothing The winter sun goes down Over town and village On the sea It makes a rosy path As if the sacred were fresh upon the water a few moments and it sinks and night comes and lights begin to spark sparkle in the prospect on the hillside beyond the shape of shapelessly defunded town and in the quiet keeping of the trees that cured, cured the village steeple remembrance are caught in stone and planted in some help.